Hello and welcome to Stock Voyage. We're checking out this week's biggest trades from Wall Street Bets. For this episode, we're going to count how many Lambos we could buy with last dollars. Lamborghini Gallardo to be precise, which starts at 140k. We are starting off with a young trader who lost a lot of money. Trader by the name of Skills70001, who is just 23 years old, lost a total of $155,000 after he started gambling with options. He shared a video going over his account value history. To be honest, we can see a pretty Pretty common chart. He started off well, had a big spike which slowly bled to nothing. On Robinhood he is down 100% for a total loss of $82,000 and he is left with just 1 cent. On the other broker he just straight up lost 72k. What surprises me the most is how can you get to 155k at just 23 years of age and then be dumb enough to lose it all. At that age most people have student debt but this guy somehow got to $155,000 and then he just lost it all. Just for perspective. If he invested this money in the S&P 500 index, he would be a millionaire in 20 years, which is a long time but at least he would have something instead of nothing. Well if he was able to get to 155k at 23, he can probably do it again. Next up we have an absolute chat with an insane gain of around $300,000 in just 3 days. Trader by the name of 6 digits all zeros made a more than 800% gain in just 3 days. He was actually in the previous episode in which he made more than 100k in just 1 day. So this is basically the continuation of the story. In the past month he is up by around 40,000% which is the same as multiplying your money 400 times. Just completely insane. He made so much money so quickly by buying spy puts with an expiration date on January the 10th. If you somehow don't know the market recently dropped because of fears over inflation which made this guy a lot of money. Next we have a trader who lost 100% of his money. A trader by the name of Lost Life Savings and GME lost a total of 72,150 $5.40 in the past two years. He's left with just 96 cents. What is quite surprising is that his account just dropped in value. He was never green. It's even crazier when you realize that in the past two years he never got in profit. He also shared some text messages with Reagan. You like Reagan's photo. Reagan invited you to start the chat. Ahaha, <laughs> I can teach you about stocks. Though my minus 72k two year return isn't too green. Like I literally have no idea what it means. I lost 72 thousand dollars in two years. I'm a professional retard. <laughs> oh no, that's okay. It's only $72,000. I like the way you think. Well, if you lost a lot of money recently, hopefully this gives you hope. And always remember to look at the losses like Reagan. It's just a million dollars, right? Next, we have a huge loss by Papa Longstroke69, who is down 96% for a total loss of $202,059.70 in the past year. He's left with just $7,000. Although, as long as he is left with enough money to pick up a Glock 9, he will be alright. His words, not mine. Hopefully, he won't have to use that $7,000 k to buy a Glock 9 though. Next we have a huge gain by Manuel. He made more than $100,000 in just one day. He is up by more than 100%. Based on what he wrote it must be because of options on Zynga. The stock went up by more than 45% on January the 10th because Take-Two Interactive, the company behind Grand Theft Auto, is acquiring Zynga. Well hopefully he wasn't greedy and secured the back. Next up we have yet another young trader who lost a lot of money, Loud Pineapple. He is just 26 years old and lost two first of his whole wealth. He lost 81% of his money or $77,000 in total. Now he's left with just $17,000. He's asking about some recommendations on stocks. Because if the next YOLO doesn't work out, he'll probably have to eat ramen noodles for the rest of his life. Although I don't think this is the best place to ask for investing advice. Especially after you lose almost everything. Hopefully if he does end up YOLOing the rest of his money, he will at least double it. Next we have a gain by drawing pole 10. He made a huge gain percentage wise on Zynga. He's up by more than 1400% or $42,000 in total. He made so much money buying call options on Zynga with a striking price at $6.50. He bought them at an average cost of $0.15. Cents. Then he sold them at $2.26 each. Expiration date is on January the 21st. So he still has some time before expiration. But hopefully he sold and secured the bag. Next we have an insane loss by 10th higher. He's down by more than 100% or $107,000 in total. 
total. He somehow got into negative. I'm beginning to believe this isn't even so rare, but I still don't even know how that's possible. So yeah, he's left with minus $2.24. He lost his money the typical Wall Street bets way. First option sprint a lot of money, then a slow bleed until you're broke. And last but not least, we have a trader who lost almost everything. Trader by the name of Nidor Raccoon1298. Lost 99% since he started trading. He lost a total of $89,872.28. The funniest part is that he laughs when he sees the losses. He's also asking if he is effed or retarded. Well, by the end of this 5 minute video, we have lost 4.9 Lambos. Last week, we've seen some of the biggest trades in this series. Someone even lost around $800,000. And all you have to do is click the video that just popped up. And if that is not enough, smash the subscribe button and press the notifications bell down below so you get notified whenever I post a video. If you have any questions or recommendations, leave them in the comments down below and thanks for watching.